Some lucky students from the New York City area are in the Syracuse area for a few days learning all about the environment. News Channel Line's Victoria Kellogg tags along for part of the two-week program. In the noise and hustle in Brooklyn, Kaylee Doverin found her calm somewhere unexpected her sophomore year, underwater in the New York Aquarium. Once I found out about like the work they do, the conservation work they do and how they try and save marine animals and species, I realized that was something I wanted to focus on in the rest of my life. Kaylee is just one of the dozens of students who are wrapping up their two-week adventure of climate science and a first-hand look at projects that put the community at the top of their to-do list. So we have to return it to its current form or a better form, right? So we're going to make it better. We know about highways in New York City, but we don't really know like the process of them being built. I would have never thought about it or like the communities that they're trying to give back to. Their Syracuse tour opened a new perspective, sparking questions and maybe even planting the seed for where science could lead them next. Having students be here learning from professionals in different environmental fields and the connections between environmental science and justice as well as state jobs is an opportunity to learn to teach them um, about careers that are available for them as they get older. Leaving the Salt City with something more, a new way to see the world and maybe their place in it. At University Hill, Victoria Kellogg, News Channel 9. And the students will wrap up their two-week learning adventure and head up north to the Adirondacks to study climate science in the field.